also suprem white supremacist groups are going to meet in eastern Tennessee. Have you heard of Stormfront, Lewis? It's kind of like the Facebook for white supremacists. Right. It's online. It's a virtual gathering for like-minded people to uh, talk about white supremacy. The Tennessee conference represents a rare offline gathering. A lot of these times, these guys don't really want it. Mostly men don't want to be seen anywhere in real life. They, they prefer to kind of uh, sit behind their computers. Because so they're this, cowards. Your words, not mine. Mm -hmm. The two-day agenda includes a luncheon. It includes workshops on immigration, political organizing, and communications by some of the white supremacist movement's best-known contemporary leaders. You know who's going to be there? No. Former presidential candidate and white supremacist and former KKK member David Duke. And mm. fascinating, he's going to lead an informal nature walk through the Smoky Mountains on day two of the conference. That sounds nice. Yeah. Former Grand Wizard, of course. Um, a nature walk with David Duke sounds really nice. Maybe show what kinds of trees were the ones used for lynchings, for example. I'm sure it's a, very, it's a good retrospective on, on uh, a lot of different things. I'm sure it will be very informative. Now, people defend David Duke. Uh, now, I guess it's becoming the, the in thing to say, well, listen, a lot of the allegations about David Duke are not fair. Um, you only have to go to his website to see the vile stuff that he's preaching against the Jewish people. I went onto his website. What did I find? I have it in my notes here. Uh, I went on there. He talks about, he has a, a great article called Jewish Supremacist Hatred of Gentiles Founded in That Religion. He has one called U.S. Zionist Supremacists Demand Taxpayer Cash to Prevent Assimilation. And a great article about how it's normal for Jews to spit on Christians in Jerusalem. So it's a well-rounded website, I would say. Yeah, very, very well thought out, well-rounded. <laughs> I would be fascinated to get video of that nature walk with David Duke. Uh, you know what? It'd probably be pretty dull. You think so? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, too bad. If you don't like the fact that this show is only an hour long, you can get the bonus show. The bonus show is produced and hosted by Lewis Motomedy, producer Lewis Motomedy. Today, we've got some great stories, including scientists creating memories in brains uh, chemically, artificially. I don't know what the right word is. Technologically, Lewis. Technologically? Yeah. Sure. We'll also talk about a woman who finds her ex-boyfriend living in, the, in her attic 12 years after they broke up. It's a bizarre story and plenty more. DavidPakman.com slash membership. Pennies a day. The best way to support the, the show and strong independent media. Stay tuned. Plenty more after this. The David Pakman Show at DavidPakman.com.